Marissa will be right back. Stay tuned. This Monday on Degrassi. I have 15 talented players here in only 12 spots. Jimmy's busting his butt on the court, but his teachers are busting his butt in class. You haven't read the book, have you? Busted. Total crash and burn. I'm doomed, man. If he doesn't do his homework, he's toast. If he doesn't play well in the big game, he's toast. It's a no-win situation. Will the pressure make Jimmy do something that he'll live to regret? Don't miss a new episode of Degrassi. This Monday at 9 p.m. Eastern and Pacific. In the end. If your life were a TV show, this would be it. Morning. One thing about life that'll probably never change, no one looks forward to Mondays. Monday morning blues. Unless, of course, you're in the end on Fresh Four Mondays. Four brand new episodes of our best shows every Monday night. That's a new Degrassi. It's a rite of passage. A new walk. I had a lot of fun here. And a new 24-7. You want more? Plus the hit show Clarissa. Oh, that's great. Tune in every Monday at 8 p.m. Hey, your weekend just got a little longer. Fresh for Monday, every Monday at 8 p.m. Only in the end. Now back to Clarissa. Clarissa in the end. A girl's gotta do what a girl's gotta do. Is brought to you by Jillian's. Where there's a Jillian, things to do. Junior high, where you learn algebra, French, and most importantly, the difference between who and whom. Who's your friend? We're friends, right? Friends talk to each other. Whom do you trust? So, do you promise you can keep a secret? Who's your rival? Just think, you're about to lose to a seventh grader. Whom do you love? Yeah. Who's dissing whom? Aww. Did Emmy pee her pants? Who's kissing whose boyfriend in front of whom? I'm not blind. You were all over Jimmy in there. Degrassi, if your life were a TV show, this would be it. Every Monday at 9, only in the end. If you're gonna play some street bowling, don't use your dad's best ball. Once, when he caught us using his brand new Revco Dominator, he got so mad he chased us into the next county. The Adventures of Pete and Pete. Giant Pete, Pete's brother Pete, and introducing Ellen as Pete's girlfriend. Look, you're a girl and you're a friend, and that's it! Uh, Today's adventure, what would you do for a dollar? We know this kid. Carl Slurm, who ran around his backyard da, singing to da, himself da, da, like he was da, on a highlight da, film. Da, da, yeah! He seemed like a dink, but he knew Kung Fu. Hey! So we invited him to play. What would you do for a dollar? Uh, wow! It's humiliating. It's the sport of Danish kings. Pete's the world champion, but he still smells like liverwurst. Actually, after two years of playing, it's unclear what Pete won't do for a dollar. Where's my money? Every night at six. Noggin. Becomes the end. Same channel. Different network. Totally dedicated to me. 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 Real life. Nah. Real problems. We got out of the bathroom now. I have to get something. What? Your training bra. Real anger. Don't you angry with me? I am. You've been telling everyone about my dyslexia. Mm -hmm. Real friends. Yes! For once in a life, it's you who's got the which boy should I be with problem, not me. Real favorites. Ferguson, if you're brainwashing yourself, you might want to set it on light load. Every night at 6, noggin. Becomes the end. Real life. Now. On real world, eat my dust. Pete and Pete is next. In the end. Pete and Pete will be right back. Stay tuned. There's more than one blonde teen idol that can cross the decades. Clarissa, for those who think, every night only in the end.
This Monday on Degrassi. I have 15 talented players here in only 12 spots. Jimmy's busting his butt on the court, but his teachers are busting his butt in class. You haven't read the book, have you? Busted. Total crash and burn. I'm doomed, man. If he doesn't do his homework, he's toast. If he doesn't play well in the big game, he's toast. It's a no-win situation. Will the pressure make Jimmy do something that he'll live to regret? Don't miss a new episode of Degrassi. This Monday at 9 p.m. Eastern and Pacific. In the end. If your life were a TV show, this would be it. Now, back to Pete and Pete. You learn a lot in junior high. Social studies. Do you want to dance? How'd you never ask? Current events. The whole school is talking. I swear on my life that nothing's going on. Drama. I'm not blind. You were all over Jimmy in there. It's called rehearsal. It's called backstabbing. And of course, chemistry. Yeah. Whoa. Degrassi. If your life were a TV show, this would be it. Every Monday at 9, only in the end. <laughs> I got a poem for you, right? I don't want you to laugh or anything because it's probably not good, but here it is. I tried my best. I seen a mountain and it was a fountain, fountain of beauty. Beauty is an awful thing to waste. If you have beauty, you are gifted. You have nice brown hair, nice and healthy. Healthy, wealthy hair. You have eyes that are priceless, like pearls. Your body is a figure of greatness and I hope you take this and keep it and have it deep put away. That's it. Thanks. I, it's a nice home. It should be more than nice. It should be like greatness. If it is, but I, see, I don't know how to take it. That's I, it. I needed some advice. Hey, Dad, can I talk to you for a second? There's this girl in my school, and um, she's pretty, like, and uh, we get along and everything, and I think I like her. I asked him, Dad, I'm curious what girls are ready, and I want to know if can I have a girlfriend. I think I'm old enough, and he says... The truth is, you know, I, I don't... I won't want you to date because I think you're too young. My opinion, really, I think... Like, I take my father's advice, but my opinion, I think that 12 years old is good enough age. Thanks for the conversation, Dad. You're welcome, you help me. Love you. Love you, too. I think a girlfriend is um, somebody you can relate to, talk to, somebody who's close to, and somebody who's always going to be there for you, sometimes kiss you, and um, that's what I think, mostly. You going to go to science trip? Yep. You going to come to movies on Friday? Friday. Yeah. I don't, I don't know what movie we're going to watch or what time. I'll call you the day before. I felt weird because I'm gonna go to the movies with a girl and cool I'm like all right she coming <laughs> but I want to take my time I don't want to go skipping steps I want to go like step by step time will come <laughs> Every night at 6, Noggin becomes the end. Same channel. Different network. Totally dedicated to me. 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 Real life. Nah. Real problems. Look out of the bathroom now. I have to get something. What? Your training bra. Real anger. Stop your angry with me. I am. You've been telling everyone about my dyslexia. Mm. Real friends. Yes! For once in our lives, it's you who's got the which boy should I be with problem, not me. Real favorites. Ferguson, if you're brainwashing yourself, you might want to set it on light load. Every night at 6, Noggin becomes the end. Real life. Now. Unreal world, eat my dust. That's it for the end. Come back tomorrow at 6 p.m. Eastern, 3 Pacific. Or log on to the end.com anytime, day or night. See ya. It's now safe to shut down the end. 
This show was made by the Big Noggins at Sesame Workshop. There's more than one blonde teen idol that can cross the decades. Clarissa, for those who think, Monday nights at 8.30, only in the end. Junior high, where you learn algebra, French, and most importantly, the difference between who and whom. Who's your friend? We're friends, right? Friends talk to each other. Whom do you trust? So, do you promise you can keep a secret? Who's your rival? Just think, you're about to lose to a seventh grader. Whom do you love? Yeah. Who's dissing whom? Aww. Did Emmy pee her pants? Who's kissing whose boyfriend in front of whom? I'm not blind. You were all over Jimmy in there. Degrassi, if your life were a TV show, this would be it. Every Monday at 9, only in the end. kid love to draw like Bert? I love to draw on my computer. <laughs> and show off their drawings? Look at this picture. Then we want to put your kids' drawings and their photo on Noggin's newest show, Play With Me Sesame. Yeah! To find out how, go to noggin.com slash sesame. Play With Me! You can watch Gullah Gullah Island seven days a week on Noggin. by the Big Noggins at Sesame Workshop. Seven days a week from 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. Come play with us at the new, bigger, better noggin. All your kids' favorite award-winning characters are here with no commercials. Every day, come, come play, play with us! us. You can watch Maisie every day on Noggin. Barber. I don't know if you know this, but every barber's got an inspiration. Here's a little poem about mine. <clears throat> I've been cutting noggins now for over 30 years, and I've seen a lot of changes in hair and fur and beards. But of all the changing hairstyles I've observed in my barber's seat, no noggins have changed more than the ones on Sesame Street. Take Oscar the Grouch, for instance. Man, oh man. A better makeover I've never seen. When he dyed his orange quaff to a much more lovely green. What do you know? And Bob and Susan updated their dues as the years went by. And even once that guy to count gave a new hairstyle a try. Ah, ah, ah. And Big Bird's crown of feathers wasn't always so poofy and elegant. Gee, gee, gee. And Gordon is constantly changing his beard, stash, and bouffant. How I love the changing locks and braids and fuzz on Sesame Street. That's why I watch a tree four times a day on Noggin with my grandkids, Annie and Lil' Pete. 
And one last thing that you should know before my poem is over. Yes, me, Nikki the Barber, changed my hair to look like my pal Grover. Grover. Thanks a lot, Noggin. This show was made by the Big Noggins at Sesame Workshop. Hey, Bert, are you ready for our play date? Yeah, I think so, honey. Um, is everybody here? Uh, I am here. Hi, Furry Gone. Where, where's Grover? Grover. Oh, Grover got the fuzzy! I'm coming! I'm coming! I'm coming! Whoa! Uh oh. <laughs> Present. Well, honey, that's everyone. Well, wait a second, Bert. We're missing someone. Hmm? Oh, of course we are! You! Noggin presents a brand new way to sesame. Play with me, sesame! The show where your kid sings, draws, clicks, and plays with the Muppets. So come play with us every day at 7.30 a.m. Eastern and 9 a.m. Eastern and Pacific. Only on Noggin. Play with me! You can watch Maisie every day on Noggin. This show was made by the Big Noggins at Sesame Workshop. <laughs> Watch us as you comb your hairs. Aha! Uh -huh. All together we are saying singing! Playing! Clicking. Playing! Seven days a week from 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. Come play with us at the new Bigger Noggin. All your kids' favorite award-winning characters are here. And with Noggin's newest show, Play With Me Sesame, they'll be singing, drawing, clicking, and playing with the Muppets. Come by airplane. Come by bus. Every day come, come play, play with us! us. You can watch Blue's Clues every day on Noggin. This show was made by the Big Noggins at Sesame Workshop.